this episode, we're going to have a look at an older feature in Rails called Current Attributes, and it was something that was released back in Rails 5. And it's one of those controversial items because there's a lot of things that it does great, but if it's abused, then it can also cause a lot of headaches in your applications. And essentially, Current Attributes allows us to have a single DIN that we're then allowed to create attributes on and assign values to. It is thread isolated, so it'll get set and reset on each request. But basically, for the life of that request, anything that you feed into the current attributes would be globally accessible throughout the application. And did you know that you can go to railstore.com to get your own Ruby on Rails t-shirt or your Drift and Ruby t-shirt? To watch this full episode and more videos, visit driftandruby.com and subscribe to the Pro Membership.